Hello, 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 everybody, and welcome to Windows World. Today we are going to be talking more cubes survive. Nefeshu, I don't know if I mispronounced your name, and if I did, I'm sorry. And he has some challenges. Anyways, this is the more cubes version of cubes survival. Rules are no cheats or cheating mods, so not playing and to uh, play on normal or hard. You're allowed to break cubes in this version, and there's no nether or add. And just to show you the options, set to normal. And challenges are collect wood, craft torches, make farm for wheat, melon, and sugar cane, find cocoa beans and cookies, mine coal, iron, gold, lapis, redstone, and diamonds, find sunken treasure, find all three emeralds, mine clay. Find dungeon, make something with diamond, build a house, find some trees, make mushroom stew, mine glowstone, brew potions, enchant items, and one, two, three, and chest, and another two. And that's it. And we're gonna throw that in there. And we keep that. And we have a sheep. And of course, there's a challenge that goes unsaid. And there's this guy. I'm probably going to do the do a few episodes of this until we can get the achievements done, and I'm already going to start work on the farm. So I'm going to gather some seeds. And Mr. Sheep, we're going to leave him alone. You can't eat him, no matter how desperate you are. So. Get over there, sheep. Well, I'm telling you, if he keeps getting in our way, I might think twice about him. I'll get her some more. That's the first. Achievement down. We got to do it. And yeah, I know you guys. Probably bored seeing everybody start off with a bunch of trees, but it's Minecraft. I mean, what more can I tell you? You can't start a Minecraft game by doing anything but punching down trees. Resource going to be a lot of seeds I can't get to it. Again, as with most sky blocks. So this isn't technically a sky block mod, but it's very similar. Because if you look out here, other than a couple other cubes, we're in a block in the sky. So it's very similar to a sky block map in that respect. So resources gathered. More. It's cool that we have an extra sapling. Each of the varieties in there. Oh crap, I think it's glass. Excuse me. At least we have a couple of oak saplings. And I'm not going to worry about getting the rest of this wood until I get an axe. Yeah. But I'm not going to worry about making the axe until I do gather some copper. I do want to see how many saplings we can gather and then bust the leaves and some more. So we have a little bit of room to, to work around. Okay, four saplings. At least we have four oak saplings, which means we have wood. And we are allowed to break glass in this one. So that means that we can. No, and there's no rule against this. 
And I wonder how many people have literally thought outside the box. There's no rule against being able to build outside of the mm -hmm. That's right. And yes, you may say it's a workaround, you may even say it's cheap. But, technically, look it up online, I found this map on nine mine back. There is literally no rule stating as of yet, there's no change. There's no rule stating as of yet that you cannot go outside of the cube. And that there's spiders. So apparently there's at least a hollow point somewhere in this map. Crafting table. Yeah, for right now. And we got this cobble. I have a certain way I set up my tools, which is why you'll see that I'm putting there's a hole. So if we can do something like this. Ah, oh, I got it. And then dungeon. It's appearing to be getting darker. Which is not going to be good if things are going to be starting to spin. Which means we are going to need to. That. I'm going to stick right there for now. A little bit of light going on here. One of four torches. some light in here and also when they say this is another workaround place torches on grass yeah I got that back so Is up in here. And like I said, we're on brick glass. So, gather wood, check. The torches, check. Find a dungeon. Don't know if that's a dungeon. I couldn't see it clearly enough yet. And that. And we have that. I would also like to make a shovel. And we can make a little bit more charcoal. We're going to be able to gather this wood real quick. And I have an idea for a tree farm. So. In order for that, we're going to need all this wood that we can get. And 
I'm gonna chop this one down. Get a little bit more sand in there. Don't want to spread any further. So what I need to do. So I'm spreading over all of our grass. Because I do want to keep the grass. And we have enough to get another achievement right out of the way real quick. Which will also get something else for us. A source of food without food water. That's what I'm gonna call the sheep. I'm gonna call it book. Again, I don't know if I just have three words. Okay. Why did I just miss this tree entirely? I have no idea. Have some stuff left that other pit can be used as fuel. want to do it, I don't need to do it. The only thing I need to do with this grass, these grass plants here, is I need to leave some grass. Because I may want to spread the grass somewhere. Move it out of the way, sheep. Now we have some more chairs. We are getting a lot of that stuff. And I'm gonna harvest some resources over there's some corn. Since it did not say that we could not build outside of the cube, I think that's what my plan is going to be. To build a tree farm. I'm going to build a tree farm on the outside. I have no idea what purpose gravel is going to serve. Well, I have one idea what I can use gravel for. Be able to get down into this spider area. We may be able to. Oh, we be able to use said gravel to. Make a stairway. You know, by dropping it down. I'm gonna gather some resources. Oh, there's iron. Because we've got coal. Check out the checklist. 
the iron chest there, the chest place there. And now we just need to find gold. This cup is in there. By using the glass. Oh, there was a dungeon I saw it. By the sound of it, it's probably a spider dungeon. That here. It's not a good enough to look at it yet. So, what I'm going to do. That is a spider dungeon. Your spiders, but I'm not seeing any spiders. Four pieces of coal. I'm going to use a piece. Some chest number one, two, some iron, some redstone, oh, yeah. golden apple, and we found cocoa beans. So that's awesome. That's part of that. Cocoa beans, I need to get some iron, bread, wheat, bread, wheat, and <coughs> Alright, now. Apparently, we're at the bottom of the cube. So, yeah, that was our stairway. That was fun. There's a surprisingly large amount of resources in these small cubes of redstone. You can't harvest that until we're very, very thick, which now we'll be able to. And there's gold. I don't think we can harvest gold for this thing. And I'm still hearing the zombies. I suppose if there was another hidden, hidden dungeon somewhere here. Zombie spawner would be nice. Zombies can spawn. Just go until this place breaks. And there's that. I can't break the bedrock, so I'll place the torch there. Hang on. That, I believe, is a good start. A lot of resources. chest down so we can keep getting uh, a place for our resources. Okay, book and coral that can go there. Wood I'll put on this level. Everything wood is going to go on this row. 
cobblestone on the there. Farming and food items. We go on these two rows. We have trees. There's some more cobblestone, some coal, some cement. Okay, that's a food item. That's a food item. Huh. Now we'll use the other chest right there to put resources in. Oh, resources in this way means crap. But we got it. And my pick is back. Mushroom. That can be a nice little food bar. Of course. We can have mushrooms too. We would give them a couple of red mushrooms, you know? So if that'll start growing, that would be awesome. We need to get a name tag somehow. We need a name for it. He's gonna, he's gonna stick with us until the end. Yes, he is. Okay, I need some wood. And I'm going to start working on one little project for us. And I believe... Okay, that's, that's the bat. I don't need that. I do need this, and we'll see why. Because we are allowed to break the glass. So, awesome. I'm going to treat this just like a sky block. We have a lot of stone that we can use. So I'm going to use stone for the moment. I want a piece of, a piece of that bread because, yeah. If we fall, just like on the sky block. Holy hell, look at the creepers. Cool. Dodgy as all hell. You may wonder why I'm doing this. Because. Tree farm. I can use some of these to expand our resources a, a quite a bit further. Which I should have thought about that originally, but you know, it is what I go for. Close the gate so Fluffy doesn't escape. Nice area. And you know how I said I'm gonna treat this like I'm a tree sky block. Mm -hmm. When I play sky block, I play sky block a little differently than a lot of people play sky block. I have a couple pet peeves in Skyblock. But some people that play Skyblock. You know, and I'm not mentioning any names. I mean, it is whatever. Anyway, it's not a big deal, so if you do it, I don't care. But I don't like to play. There's people that just take a piece of dirt and just plunk it down on top of their platform. So you have a nice flat, even platform, and then all of a sudden a piece of dirt sticking up. Just randomly out of the middle of nowhere. They're just a random piece of dirt sticking up out of the platform with a tree growing out of it. And I'll show you what I mean. 
as soon as I take this out, a couple more places. Uh, what I do, I place guy block to continue with my original thought, is I build a double platform. Get a little tired. I'm holding the shift so I don't fall off the edge of the platform here. And we're not going to have enough. I want gray. Oh well, any of one is, it doesn't matter. And I'll show you what I'm talking about that bugs me. A piece of dirt. We'll get an oak sapling because it's apples. And we'll come up here. What bugs me is when people do this. They stick a piece of dirt down and throw a tree on it. That bugs me. Okay? I don't I don't play sky block that way. Like I said, if you if you do this, if you use this idea, I don't care. If you do that with your sky blocks, you just chunk a piece of dirt down and just do whatever. It doesn't matter, you know. I'm not saying that it's right or wrong. I'm just saying it's the way I like to play sky block. But this is what I'm talking about. I build a double platform. I do this because I can place dirt down and I can retrieve the dirt. Easily without it being tossed over into the void. And I'm such an idiot. I turned all of our cobble into slabs without replacing my pick. But we still have the wooden one in there, so it's not a big deal. I can use the wooden pick to get three pieces of cobblestone. To make ourselves a replacement for it. Not a big issue. And so, I mean, I don't know if you would consider this a cheat or not building outside the platform or building outside the cube. If you do, let me know. If you, if you think it's okay, let me know. Either way, you know, this is how I'm going to play this map. I'm going to treat it like a sky block because they're so similar. And it's technically not against the rules. And is it thinking literally outside the box? Yeah, a little bit. But that's me, you know. I do that. And I'm going to need more. Cobble anyhow to finish this because treating it like a sky block, I'm going to build my safety rails. One so famous for a sky block. And if anything spawns out there during the night, that'll be cool. We need to, oh, 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 oh that's what we can do. That's what we can do. I'm going to go two. Three, and that'll give us three, four, yeah, three. And maybe not we need an iron pick anyhow. Okay. One piece of wool. You're going to have to be not so fluffy for the moment. I need to do something. Ah, oh, shit. What was I going to do? Oh, here it is. Okay. We need this. No torches. We need one. We need one right here. I need to do like a good 
I don't care. It's up. We're gonna need a couple down here. Last thing I want is crap starting to spawn underneath me and coming up and scaring the crap out of me. Mm -hmm. So, oh, some more iron. That's awesome. Like that. And I can literally, I can mine this level out. Uh, yeah, I could probably mine that level. Or do I want two row, two layers? I'm gonna leave the two layers. I like that. I have an idea for that. The layer. I will take resources from that level though. And like I said before. What are you doing down here, Fluffy? Can you get back up there so you can eat grass so you can grow your wool so I can make a bed? Oh, that's sketchy as well. hell. One piece of glass between us and the table. I don't like glass floors, so I'm going to cover that back up. Put them over here. I wish we could break bedrock with a little slab and a piece of the bedrock popping up out of the floor. I don't even know where. For an outer coil, I'll call it bottom floor. You know, there's a layer between us. Eventually, I'm going to utilize that spider spawner. You know what? I can get some meat. I'm going to leave Fluffy back upstairs. I feel like damn zombies again. What the hell are those zombies? Oh crap. And I'm looking for a diamond. May not even be in this game. I want to empty this out a little bit. At the moment, we have plenty of iron, so I'm not worried about losing up. There's lapis. Now all we need is diamond. I'm gonna open up this a little bit here. Need more lapis. I might as well grab it. I'm gonna open up this. I'm going to make something. We're gonna find Fluffy. Come on, Fluffy. Time to go home. You go upstairs. Did you go upstairs, Fluffy? You must have. I'm such an addict when it comes to mining. If I see something, I have to mine it. If I see a resource, I have to mine it. Okay, now, tell me if Luffy went all the way back upstairs. He did. Good boy, Luffy. Okay. Now, I need to make something real quick. We have plenty. I'm going to have to put it on. Hey, hey, hey. Damn it, Fluffy. Such a pain in my ass. Where'd you go, Mr. Pichu? 
You don't want to be down there now. Come on. Come on, Fluffy. I'm going to have to make two more of them. Okay. Apparently, we all have anything like that. But it's okay. That can go there. Go back to our tree. Let that grow. Let it eat back. Actually, get one more thing out of the way in this episode. Cookies. Achievement yet. Yeah. That's right. Cookies. Let's see what all we've accomplished in this episode. Collect wood, check. Craft torches, check. We don't have the wood yet. Find cocoa beans and make cookies, check. For the mining one, all we're lacking is diamond. Okay, find some trade with them over here. I'm going to find clay. Find dungeon, check. Make some more diamond. Okay, we have that. Double house, plant some trees. Planted. Is it plant some trees? I planted one. I don't feel right about saying that one's got to be Mushroom stew, check. Glowstone potions and shell. Well, what we can do... Plant some trees, check. Uh, so we didn't say we had to leave them there. I don't know, that's a technicality, so. but we got a tree farm, and it's going to grow, it's going to be bigger than what it is. I'm not just going to grow one tree at a time. I'm going to make a big enough tree farm to at least have three growing at a time. So, that will... That will grow and spread. Yeah, I made a double, making a double, making a double platform. So that way, in case you know, creeper blows up, we might have some kind of leeway where they're not gonna fall away. But see us, red mushroom. That's the way we're gonna be able to obtain some food. But as long as we leave mycelium and leave one of each type of mushroom, that'll be a renewable food resource. And we started farming some of that. That's going to be pain. But this is clay. That's an achievement out the way. I did not see that thing before. Oops, a piece of sand. I will between episodes harvest all of that. I don't know what we're gonna use clay for yet. Or if we're going to use it at all. But let me know what you guys think. And this is Wizard. And I'll catch you on the flip side. Say bye bye, shit. Say bye. Say bye bye, Fluffy. See you guys later. Have a good one. Stay blessed. Bye bye.